Welcome back to the official SAF hosting YouTube channel, my name is Sally and today we'll be going through and showcasing our VPS and root server interface, so let's get going. On the dashboard page you can find your server AP, start, stop and reset the server, check the CPU, RAM, disk and traffic usage. On the access and security page, you can find the login credentials to your server. You can also activate or disable password login and generate an SSH key. On the event log page, you can check the stopped, started or restarted the server. And if the server crashes, you will find the log file of the unexpected shutdown. On the settings page, you can change the hostname, root password, reinstall the server and enable docker. On the game server page, you can install a game server or TeamSpeak server with just a few clicks if you own a VPS or root server with Linux operating system. If you're interested in this, check out the video description where you will find a link leading to a tutorial on how to use this feature. On the VNC console page, you can easily open the console of your server with just one click. On the reset traffic page, you can reset your bandwidth for a fee if you exceed our 5TB limit. On the DDoS manager page, you can check if there are any incoming DDoS attacks. You can also choose between the permanent and sensor mode, and if needed, enable notifications, so in case of an attack, we will inform you via email. On the rescue mode page, you can save your server's data in case your server doesn't start anymore and needs to be reinstalled. That's it for today. If you have any more questions, feel free to contact our support via ticket or live chat and they will be more than happy to help you out. Now, have a lovely rest of the week. Bye.